don't bother Victor. In the hills of Sodor, the narrow gauge engines puff and chuff their hearts. Sometimes they chuff too hard, and then there's trouble. One morning, Peter Sam puffed into the depot. He had been shunting coal all night. Thomas was there. Hello, Thomas. You look cheery. I am. I always like puffing to the hills. I am to take the thin controller down to Napfa Station. Peter Sam oozing happily. Then the thin controller arrived. Good morning, Peter Sam. Good morning, Thomas. Good morning, sir. I must meet with the fat controller. All the other engines are busy today. So, I told them that you, Peter Sam, will be in charge while I am away. Peter Sam gasped. He had never been in charge before. Of course, sir. Please remember that Victor will come this afternoon for his weekly repair visit. You must let him know if any engine needs to be fixed. Of course, sir. But don't bother Victor before his visit with little things. Victor is a very busy engine. I know, sir. I won't bother Victor. Good luck, Peter Sam. Being in charge is fun. You make all the decisions. Peter Sam watched Thomas wheesh away with the thin controller. His wheels wobbled. Being in charge for the day is very exciting. But maybe just a little bit scary. Then, Reneus chuffed in. The handle is creaking and croaking at the halt. You must fetch Victor. Peter Sam looks serious. No, Reneus. We mustn't bother Victor with little things. I will chuff to Sir Handel. And Peter Sam chuffed away to the halt. Sir Handel was creaking. Oh, my, Sir Handel. Please fetch Victor. Peter Sam wished. Sir Handel needed fixing, but the thin controller had told him not to bother Victor. So Peter Sam made a decision. I'm sure I can fix you, Sir Handel. Really? Peter Sam huffed and he puffed. He thought hard of the very best way to fix a handle. Then an idea bubbled in his boiler. Roll forward. Sir Handel creeped slowly forward. Ah, yes. You need oil, Sir Handel. Then you'll be rolling in no time. So Peter Sam's driver poured oil into Sir Handel. Sir Handel wished worried. Now, roll forward, Sir Handel. Sir Handel creaked louder and longer than ever, and he couldn't roll forward at all. Bust my buffers. Maybe that wasn't the right thing to do. Then Reneus chuffed up. Scalo is by the water tower. Something is wrong with his funnel. You must fetch Victor. Peter Sam looks serious. No, Reneus. We mustn't bother Victor. I will chuff to Scarloe. Are you sure? I'm sure. So Reneus chuffed away, and Peter Sam left Sir Handel creaking to puff to Scarloe at the water tower. Scarloe was wishing with worry. Hello, Peter Sam. My funnel is blocked. I can't puff or chuff. Please fetch Victor. Peter Sam was worried. He hadn't fixed Sir Handel and now Scarloe needed help. But he had told the thin controller he wouldn't bother Victor. Don't worry, Scarloe. I'm sure I can fix you. Really? Peter Sam huffed and he puffed. He thought hard of the very best way to fix Scarloe. Then an idea popped in his pistons. A little water down your funnel will soon clear it. So, water splashed into Scarloe's funnel. There you are, Scarloe. 
You can chuff cheerfully now. But Scarlo, he couldn't chuff at all. All that water has put my firebox out, Peter Sam. Oh my, I'm sorry, Scarlowy. Maybe splashing water wasn't the right thing to do. Then Renee is steam by. Duncan's rods are rattling. He needs Victor. No, Reneus. We mustn't bother Victor, Victor with little, little things. things. So Peter Sam left Scarloe, and he puffed away to find Duncan. Then, with a rattle, Peter Sam huffed to a halt. Bust my buffers! I was so busy not bothering Victor, I didn't stop at the coal hopper after my busy night. Now I've run out of coal. I can't be in charge. I can't look after my friends. And I can't puff to find Victor. This is a disaster. Then he heard Reneus. Reneus, fetch Victor. I've broken down. I'm sorry, Peter Sam, but you said we can't bother Victor with the little things. And Reneus steamed on. Peter Sam felt silly and alone. Then he remembered what Thomas had said. When you're in charge, you can make the decisions. So, I can decide that broken engines aren't just little things. And I can decide that we need to bother Victor. So Peter Sam whistled as long and as loudly as he could. Suddenly, he heard the clickety-clack of an engine. It was Reneus. Yes? Reneus, you were right. Reneus was puzzled. I made a silly decision not to fetch Victor. We need to bother Victor. Please, will you fetch him? Of course I will, Peter Sam. <laughs> Soon, Victor had whooshed all the way to help Peter Sam. Victor had brought coal for him. Why didn't you find me there? Because the thin controller said not to bother you until your visit. Bother me? It's my job to fit really useful engines in trouble. And it makes me very happy. <laughs> Puff with me. So Victor fixed Scarlowy's funnel. Thank you, Victor. And he fixed her handles creaking. Thank you, Victor. And then Peter Sam chuffed back to the depot, just as the thin controller puffed in on Thomas. How was your damn charge, Peter Sam? Peter Sam chuffed and puffed, then he smiled. My day wasn't a bother at all, sir. <laughs> the thin controller was pleased. Victor chuckled. That's right, sir. No bother at all. <laughs> <laughs>